How's it going, everybody? And uh, we're just kind of going to go through stuff old and new and things that were kind of picked up over the month or maybe last month or this month. It might have been last month. But anyways, it's going to be, this is officially going to be, I'm going to tag it, make it a tag video maybe. I don't know, like a chat May Awareness Week. So I'm starting off this week. Well, it's already middle of the week, but it's still whatever. Who cares? It's a chat May Hump Day, middle of the week, uh, honorary holiday thing or whatever. But anyhow, um, I picked this figure up a while back because I didn't have it. It's a um, Beast Raider, Warriors of the Savage. Savage Warrior figure playset. It's not really a playset. Cause it's just a figure. But um, there are some cool pics of other figures in the background. Some weird looking thing. Let me hold on. Let me zoom into that. Uh, oh yeah, it's a um, it's a hero on some kind of pterodactyl looking beast, and this baddie bad guy from I think the thing that I hooked up uh, Overlord with that I had doubles of. But yeah, and then there's this green looking um, guy that kind of reminds me of uh, one of the bad dudes from gummy bears or something or some weird something i don't know it reminds me of something goofy and kind of reminds me of a motu dude and there's another cool dinosaur looking thing looks like a t-rex in the background but yeah let's um let's pop them open take them out of the card because a lot of buddies have been getting down with the chat maze and i have a few things i don't have a lot they're kind of hard to find um here in the states some people have them some people don't it's better to go online and look for them overseas but um but yeah this guy's pretty cool let's see if he stands up because that's the first thing about chat may toys that they can stand he kind of stands up well yeah he's not well i don't know okay but but they can fall over pretty easily so what you probably want to do is um get them find a way to get them hot and oh actually yeah his legs move so that's cool not too bad because I can't remember from any of my other uh, Beast Raider guys that they can have legs that move, so that helps. But um, I could swear this other set that I have of these figures don't have uh, movable legs. But yeah, this dude is awesome. Kind of want to go find more of these guys now, but I'm not going to do it, so. Ain't going to do that. Ain't going to do that. This guy is ratty cakes. He's got some bullets, which is weird. <laughs> not very medieval. Or not very Dungeons and Dragony, but uh, yeah, he's got some holes back here for stuff. I don't know where you could put wherever if you can find some uh, pegs or some accessories that would fit in there. That'd be oh, actually, those are screw holes. Forgive me, those are screw holes. But maybe you might be able to peg something in there, customize them or something, do whatever you want. Paint's not bad, but yeah, pretty cool. Nice little chainmail boots and stuff. Some spiky boots. Then he's got another spear. Britney Spear and uh, let's see but yeah pretty cool figure I like him he's like <laughs> but yeah cool really cool figure and I'm glad I picked him up because he's actually worthy and I'm glad I unboxed him because sometimes I don't know you can keep stuff in the box all day long and just have it take up space or you can actually open the toy up and check it out and see if it's really fun and uh, yeah, I think this guy's pretty fun. I think these weapons make him a little top heavy though. So it's kind of, he can lean back. But yeah, that guy's awesome. And then here's another thing I picked up from Chat May on eBay. That I believe it is Chat May. I could be wrong, I could be right. Uh, and it is Chat May, because the seller is honest. Um, it's a big old Loch Ness looking dinosaur. I forget what you call these dinosaurs because I'm not a dinosaurologist. But it's a big old Loch Ness monster. This thing is huge. I think it's about 14 inches in length, maybe, or so. I can't remember. But uh, this thing's pretty cool. It has a jaw that moves a little bit. Not too much. Paint on it is pretty rad. Or pretty extreme. Pretty uh, Nachos Dorito Extreme. Really cool face sculpt. And you can move. Oh, the head is movable. It does move right there. And it has a cool action feature, so. So let's uh, see if we can attack this dude. If they can battle. If they can battle. They be battling. But, um, like a hip-hop battle or a rap battle. But, rah, rah. But, yeah, that's pretty cool. And you can move his fins or her fins. It's whatever you want to call it. It could be a dude, dinosaur, or a chick, dinosaur, or whatever. Or you could have it just walk like that. 
I don't know. You can do whatever you want with it. But yeah, that's about as much as they move. And um, yeah, there's a little button for the, make the net moves. I think it's pretty cool. I like it. I think it's worth the purchase. I think I got it for a pretty good deal. I know it was less than 20 bucks. I don't, I don't pay too much for it. But I wonder if it's... Not, the head doesn't move there, so I don't even force it, but yeah. It's still pretty cool. Let's see if we can get the, this goblin guy or whatever in the mouth. But yeah, you can fit it in the mouth, so that's pretty cool. That is worthy. Awesome. Anyhow, it's just a little chat may awareness week, a middle of the week thing uh, that I wanted to do because I haven't, I haven't done anything like that in a while. And I know a lot of people out there like some chat may stuff. Anyways, thanks for watching. More videos and stuff always on the way. And have fun, play with your toys, and be cool. And uh, yeah, um, thanks for watching. Appreciate it. Later.